Hey, what it be? It's your boy Dre OG. Welcome back to the OG family. Make sure y'all smash that like button. Subscribe to my channel if you're rocking with the vibes and the content. Today we got this. What is something people do that make you immediately not trust them? I'll let y'all know one of mine's right now, and I'm gonna let y'all know a couple more during this damn video. But look, when I see you early in the morning, we having a conversation and your breath stink, I just lose trust because I don't believe nothing you say because it's too early to be talking shit. But look, man, <laughs> let's get into this video, man. Hey, man, hopefully y'all having a good day. Just know we're going through this thing called life together. Let's get it. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? When they have, like, a penis. <laughs> what is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? <laughs> what? Yeah, I just get on with boys so much better than I do girls. Like, boys are just less drama, you know? Like, less drama. <laughs> Sounds like you could be the drama. Sounds sounds like you're the drama, maybe. X. Sounds like sounds like that's probably the case, isn't it? Yeah. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? If a guy ever says that he's not good enough for you as like some kind of pickup line, just believe him and keep it moving. Because I think sometimes girls are like, oh my God, then he's gonna worship me because he doesn't think he's good enough for me. That's where you're wrong, sweetie. <laughs> he has that belief. He's acting on that belief when he's interacting with you. Unless he changes that belief, he will never think he's good enough. And he's always going to think that you're sticking around for something that you deserve better than. That's a very slippery slope. Because everybody has inherent value. And until someone can realize their own inherent value, there's really nothing that other people can say or do that will convince them otherwise. You don't need to help him realize that. He needs to realize that on his own. So if he says that you deserve better or that you're too good, you are. Next. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? If somebody's telling you that they better. miss you and you've only been on one date or two dates with them, even three, miss you, who exactly are they missing? Because they don't know you yet. I know. I know we can get all excited like, oh, they miss me. But... But how do they? Because they don't know you. You've spent all of like 10 hours with them. Why don't I trust that? Because they've already created this idea of you in their mind. And when the real you shows up, when they get a glimpse of the real you, they're going to be sadly disappointed. Not because you're disappointing, but because you can't match something that's a fantasy. When do we actually miss somebody? We miss somebody who has taken up space in our life. Somebody who has value so that when they're gone, it leaves a gap. And dolls, you can't leave a gap yet because two weeks ago, they didn't even know you existed. I'm not saying run. I'm just saying take note, hold it loosely, and keep your eyes open. Just a thought. You know what, though? She has a point. Out of all of them, it started off just like, she said if you have a penis, she don't trust you. All right, bet. This shit started off completely like, I wasn't expecting that. I'm like, oh, shit. Oh, oh, they talking shit about us. <laughs> but it, it, it's all good, though, because, you know, I know that they're not talking about all of us and stuff like that. It's cool. But this woman has a point, though. Somebody saying that they already miss you, man, it might be some underlying issues that that person has. And you, you, ha you have to really watch out for that, man. Stop trying to fall in love too fast and stuff, man. Just let it happen, all right? Real talk. That shit a little weird, though. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? Okay, I went on a date with this guy. He took me to a restaurant. And when the waitress came around and asked us if we wanted to drink, he ordered a cold glass of milk. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? Listen, I'm not racist. But, I mean, I tolerate the LGBTQ people. But. But, well, I'm not Islamophobic. But, you know, I get it, what we do with the climate change, blah, blah, blah. But, but. I respect everybody. <laughs> I'm a gentleman. And I respect women. But. But listen, I don't understand why you think that I offended you. I get it. You felt uncomfortable. But, but. these people might as well say, I'm not an idiot, but... What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? When a guy says he's a trustworthy person and he's a good person, that means he's not. Because think about it, would a pretty person come up to you and be like, hey, I'm pretty? No, they just be it. What is You know what though, like she got a point though, even though they keep slandering us and shit, but it's okay, I can take it. I've been taking it all my life. Pause, 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 pause. pause. That's why let's replay that shit. 
Replay that shit. Gotta cut that shit out. <laughs> but nah, look. Check me out, though. Check me out. She, she got a point, though, because the simple fact is you, you shouldn't be explaining yourself to people. That's what getting to know people is. I hate when people say, oh, yeah, I'm such a good person. I had this girl, but she was bad, right? But she kept telling me, oh, she's such a good person. She's this type of... Her whole purpose was to just convince me that she was a good person, that it just drew me into a shell. I had to... That's how you get ghosted. Self-absorbed, all that other shit, man. Don't nobody care about none of that. Don't nobody care about all those followers. None of that shit. Like that shit lame. Weird. Something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them. When someone's entire social circle look, dress, and just act the exact same way. Here's an example. Yeah. We've all seen this famous image of you know christian girl autumn Never seen i have it. no problem with people who do look like this and dress like this but when you have that many friends who all look and dress and probably talk the exact same way i just don't trust you i'm sorry another example no i don't trust you what i mean i mean we could say i don't trust your grown ass drinking out that little juice box like you know but we can keep moving on though but i feel it though one does or says that makes you immediately not trust them when someone says they're an open book, what I learned from being a psychiatrist, everybody has a secret. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? This is going to be a controversial opinion, but I do not trust people who don't swear or judge other people for swearing. And I am reading from a study right now. We found a consistent positive relationship between profanity and honesty. Profanity was associated with less lying and deception at the individual level and higher integrity at the social level. Some research shows that people who swear are less likely to lie during police interrogations. And a 2015 study concluded that intelligent people tend to use more swear words. Swear word fluency is positively correlated with overall verbal fluency. People People who are good at language are good at generating a swearing vocabulary. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. What is something that <laughs> someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? Flip flops. If I see you wearing flip flops anywhere that isn't the beach, I have a problem with you. Hold on, hold on. Anybody. See, I don't like that because, you know, I wear flip flops and shit. He didn't try me though. Like, boy, anybody with a weak ass beard like that. Anybody with a beard that's not as thick as mine, below mine, I'll look down on you, fish pop, weirdo, and get your teeth fixed. Flip flops. Did I go too far? I'm gonna keep going. I have a serious problem with trusting you. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? When people want to come to me and talk badly about their friends, gossip, shame, um, talk badly one. about them, and they expect me yeah. to connect with them, what that makes me do is shut down because guess what? That's a red flag. If you're talking about your friend that way, nice. what are you gonna say about me? And also one of the nice. biggest turnoffs for me is when someone goes, oh, can you believe she's wearing that? And expects to connect with me in that way. Why does that bother you so much that she's wearing that? That's the bigger red flag. Why does that bother you so much that she's wearing that? No. It's not gonna work. Can't connect with me on that level. Sorry. The only thing I wanna say about other women in public is, dang girl, look at her go. Get it girl. What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? Oh, bring on the hate. Right, anyone that wears an excessive amount of rainbow or tie-dye, like all the time, like it's their entire personality. Um, you know when you run across these people that they will tell you about their spiritual journey. And then they'll lecture you for hours on how you should live your life and what products you should buy and how everything is evil with the world whilst they tap away on their iPhone, updating their Instagram. And then they'll hand you a crystal out of their fucking bra and tell you it will heal all oh, your ails. And the reason why you're negative towards <gasps> them is because the moon is in a certain phase. Now, I was a practicing Wiccan for a very, very, very Not long time. And these people are the reason why I left. Because they're abhorrent and they're fucking everywhere. What is Hold on, oh, 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 she she's talking about Wiccans. Oh, I'm that I'm not a Wiccan. I don't I don't I don't subscribe to none of that shit, but I do have crystals and stuff. They're pretty dope, man. But I'm not gonna press my will on nobody. It's just, just me and what I do. You feel me? Like, you know, whatever. It's whatever. Something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them. 
when someone makes outwardly misogynistic jokes and thinks they're funny like ha 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 shut up and go make me a sandwich like is that supposed to be funny in any capacity and it just doesn't sit right with me when someone chooses to make women as the butt of their joke and to me it often feels like they're trying to use this disguise of it being a joke as a way to outwardly express their misogyny in public like how are rape jokes funny I don't get it. Yeah, that's not funny. What is something that someone does but or says? She don't. She don't, she don't seem like somebody that be cool to hang around, though. To be honest with you, but I do. I do get her on a. She's one of those people that just can't take a joke at all. She don't need to even hear a joke. People, they're failed attempts at jokes. It's, it is what it is. You can't be mad at everything in your life, bro. People always want to find something to to be mad about. Like, stop finding shit to be mad about. Just move on with your life. If it's not funny, get a, get from around those people immediately not trust them the people that say i'll pray for you <laughs> <laughs> they're liars <laughs> what is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them i will give you a few because that is what i do when you meet them they do not make eye contact they're always looking everywhere else but at you yeah they look you up and down but then don't give the compliment. They talk crap about right. everyone but you. If you know they're in a relationship and they're watching all the people that they could be attracted to walking around, telling secrets at an event or at a party or at a table where no one else can hear the conversation. If they're constantly acting like they need to be someplace when you know that they don't. <laughs> and these are just for fun because my family and I joke about them. People that turn their spoon upside down and eat the ice cream off of it. <laughs> people that back into parking lots. No, you're not allowed to back into a parking spot. Why not? Like, <laughs> What is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them? People that hate cats. And I'm talking specifically about people that have this fiery abhorrence towards cats. All I'm hearing when people tell me that they hate cats is that they can't handle rejection, they don't respect a creature that practices boundaries, and they're just horrible human beings. You go, what? You delusional as hell. This is just people's preference. If they don't like cats, they don't like cats. Cats got claws, they scratch you all up and stuff, man. Like, for the people who like cats, my homie, like, some of my best friends got cats. They dudes. That's fine. Have your cats. I just don't, I don't prefer cats simple like it is what it is cats are cool though nothing against them but just because they don't like cats don't mean that they're something wrong with them or anything something wrong with you your house probably stank what is something that someone does or says that makes you immediately not trust them i'll go first people who describe themselves as an empath like it's a personality trait or a spiritual belief and not just a basic human function and then they use it in a way to like put other people down like you're not as empathetic as me because mm. i'm an empath a human being not having the capacity to feel empathy is a literal psychopath so you feeling empathy is not special it's not a personality trait it's a basic human function and you turning it into this sort of identity actually kind of makes you come across like a narcissist i mean hey look when when somebody make a good point they 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 make a good point. You feel me? He made he made it he definitely made a good point. Um I would say I'm an empath too, but I, I can see where he's coming from, how that can also be deemed as like kind of toxic and too in a turn off. So I, I mean I don't speak about it. I know my feelings and stuff like that. I know I'm very sensitive to energy. I can feel when somebody's down, even if you're if you have a smile on your face. Like it's that type of vibe, but it is what it is though. I I I get where they're coming from. And that's about being human and growing up too, man. You can see you can really hear what other, where other people are coming from, man. And you don't always have to take offense to what somebody's saying, bro. That's what's wrong with most people right now. Everybody being a everybody being a feelings about the most simple things, the most simple things, man. And it, and it's lame. That's the type of people that I don't, you know, what I'm saying that I don't trust. Somebody that can't take a joke, I don't trust you. Somebody that smacks when they eat their food. I don't trust you somebody that don't know how to bro i was in vegas people don't know how to walk on the right side 
Like they they completely walking on the left, like bro, bro, walking right into you, bro. Like they don't want to move out your way. I hate that too. So uh, I just don't. Like it's a lot of things I can I can keep getting into it, you know. But even old people past their prime driving on the highway. Look, man, get you a driver. But it is what it is. It is what it is, y'all. Look, we can go on and on about this stuff. We all have our preferences about life and stuff. The dope video right here, man. Let me know which ones that y'all agree with, and let me know some. You know some things that make you not trust people right off the bat let me know in the comments down below let's get it up to like 10,000 comments y'all let us know man let the world know in this video how y'all feel but like i always say man spread love because it's too much hate in this world i love you guys i'll see you on the next video we out though